Hi guys, DuffelDarksYZ, and we are back playing Gravity Rush 2. <laughs> and we are actually in the episode 12. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> it just jumped right from episode 11 to episode 12. So, yeah, so at this point we have to try to get inside New Heralion and try to shut down the entire city. Uh, that thing barely even resembles New Heralion. Where are we supposed to find the central tower? This picture is our best hint. Right, that thing on the roof should help us find it. Okay, so I'm trying to find... a moon-shaped... a moon-shaped statue on top of a building. Okay, it's gotta be here somewhere. Oh. I think I found it. <laughs> Riven, I think this is the thing from the picture. Yeah. You're right, we found the tower. Better give Satan the signal. Here goes. Oh, okay, that's, uh, awfully convenient. <laughs> Our exit's blocked. Alright, so we gotta get to the core. Alright. Oh, look at this. More tablets. Defeat your enemies to reveal the path. So. <laughs> more after this point. Alright, ten more enemies. Where are the rest? Five more. That's a different if you haven't seen. <laughs> yeah! Okay, mission complete. Or should I say challenge complete? <laughs> I better also get some of these gems while I'm here. Yeah. 
Alright, let's got my special gauge maxed out. this oh another new power <laughs> I I think I just gained a new power <laughs> but I can't control it did something happen to you I feel so heavy you're just imagining things no it's definitely the new power doing it well, if you're done complaining, can we go? <laughs> oh, that's not good. We're trapped. Oh, ah. <laughs> You've gained weight. Raven, I'm the same way I've always been. It's just this new power that's doing it. You're trying to call me fat. <laughs> okay, so... Defeat your enemies to reveal a path. Alright, so welcome to the new style known as Jupiter. <laughs> surge kick. While in Jupiter style, hold square about three seconds to charge the surge kick. All the way, release the button to send out a powerful shock wave wherever you land it. If you don't charge it all the way, the shockwave produced will be much weaker. Hmm. So, with the Jupiter style, it pretty much focuses on, uh, like, raw power. Well, raw power and kind of destruction. Um, I mean, for right now, at least the Surge Kick is pretty good for taking care of multiple enemies at once. Yeah, so obviously it's complete opposite from the the uh, lunar style, which focuses on swift movements and you know, lightweight and swift movements. Here, it's mostly uh, like heavy weight and you know, raw power and slowness. <laughs> Yeah, promise it's kind of hard to do a combo with the uh, Jupiter style. <laughs> hmm. But, you know, I think I get the idea for um, the name Jupiter style. You know, obviously, I guess Jupiter is supposed to reference the kind of the density of the planet, you know, how dense it is, how much, in terms of weight wise, you actually would way a lot more in Jupiter compared to like here on Earth. Okay, destruction. While in Jupiter style, running into, sliding into, or attacking objects can destroy things, uh, uh, other styles cannot. Use this to your advantage if you discover some debris that cannot be cleared in other gravity styles. So, yeah, essentially having raw, uh, <laughs> I guess raw power you know, being able to destroy you know, walls and stuff like that because of the weight that you've gained.
Oof, okay. Well, that wasn't a graceful landing. Okay, debris ball. While in Jupiter's stall, stasis fields will cause objects to compress together into a, a debris ball. Hold for one second to pull nearby objects into a giant, highly compressed debris ball. Uh, press circle again to hold the compressed debris ball at your target and cause damage to the surrounding area. The bigger the ball of debris, the more powerful the attack effect will be. Okay, so... Kind of the equivalent to the piercing throw ability. Yeah, so that, I guess that's the new special attack that you can perform. Oh, okay, I was trying to get the, uh... Getting these gems. Okay, uh, give me a second here. Alright. Sorry about that. Oof. Getting trapped. Can't even jump that high. Gotta make my way across. Yes, there, yeah. All right, same as usual. It's a little bit hard to shift gravity. <laughs> so they can't really turn well. Okay, nine more. <laughs> uh, all right, four more. One more.
Right, got that. <laughs> Can't. Yeah, I can't go into a. Uh, I can't roll out after a fall, you know, being able to dodge for more graceful landing. Oh. Uh, these new Navi are kind of a little bit of a pain. I like the churches within time granted. Oh. Try my best. Oh, well, that's something kind of different, though, having to collect treasures. Or gems, most likely. Okay, um. Just three more. Okay. Uh, any place else? Okay. Just gotta get two more gems. Wow. Um, <laughs> I just need two gems. This is kind of insane. <laughs> wow. I don't know why it took a while just to get two gems. Hands are blocking me. Almost feels like a giant maze. I'm not really sure where exactly I'm going. Get through without taking damage. Okay, well, <laughs> that's gonna be a tricky one. How am I supposed to get through this without taking damage? Uh, while in Jupiter stall, sliding is faster. You can do damage when you run into things. 
This extra speed comes with a drawback. It's more difficult to turn, and you can't climb stairs. I can't climb stairs? <laughs> well, that's kind of... Well, I guess it really depends on the situation in hand, but at the very least, you can go faster. <laughs> All right. Okay, so at least for the most part, it's okay. I mean, I can somewhat control it. But I think if I'm trying to do, like, quick turns or whatever, it'd be a different story. Oh. Ah. Whoa. Oh, man. <laughs> Okay, that's nice. I was close. Yeah, so, okay, maybe now I understand what it means by losing control. Getting closer. Try not <laughs> try to avoid the walls. Well, try to avoid walls if I can, because that's what's going to make me mess up. Trying to get every single gem at this point because I don't know if I'm going to be able to come back here. All right. Huh. Okay. Ball's a little bit more tricky. Wait, Sid was on the Bismalia. We have to think, why was he on the Bismalia in the first place to make this plan possible? If you don't stop this monster, it will all be for nothing. We need to find the gravity engine and destroy it. That's what Sid would want. Alright, let's do it. Come on, Raven. Okay, <laughs> gotta find that engine quick. Oop, just passed the tablet. <laughs> special attack perform the micro black hole special attack to create a black hole 
around cat that will destroy any enemies caught inside. The black hole won't work against some tougher enemies, so be aware of when using it. Uh. Huh, well, I wasn't even close. <laughs> okay, you know, I gotta say, the uh, micro black hole in this game compared to the first game is a lot better. <laughs> I mean, it's almost like a, it's almost like a screen nuke in a way. <laughs> One more, somewhere. Oh, okay. Actually worked. <laughs> All right. I thought it'd be too big for the the black hole. Yeah. So yeah, the micro black hole is a lot better in this game than the first one because we even got some stones. Yeah. In the first game, uh, the micro black hole was more or less wasn't very much of a black hole as it was more like a tornado. And really, it was kind of on the weaker side. So really, I never really used it that much. I mostly used the... I was mostly a fan of the gravity typhoon than anything else. Um, here though, I don't know, I would say maybe the exact opposite. <laughs> I think I probably like the black hole more than the, than the gravity typhoon. <laughs> But you know, it's kind of kind of sucks that again, in order to use the micro black hole, I have to switch to a different style. <laughs> Can't just use it all in normal style. <laughs> Not exactly sure why they have to break it up like that in terms of special attacks, but well, I mean, it is what it is. <laughs> Raven, behind us. <laughs> we gotta move, it'll crush us. Let me punch through the debris. <laughs> Yeah. I'm trying to go as fast as I can. Ugh. I keep hitting the wall early. <laughs> Come on, stop hitting the wall. Oh, great. I gotta say, the core looks pretty evil. Oh man, she's getting... She got trapped by the core. <laughs> this thing swallowed Cece. What is it? It's obviously more than just some machine gone haywire. We need to take it down and get Cece out. <laughs> Defeat the gravity engine. <laughs> Uh, okay. Uh, 
Oh man, getting attacked by everything. Oh man. Trying to move. The core on its head. That's nice, man. <laughs> Oof, I'm gonna need more health at this point. Alright, so just keep attacking these things. Pretty good amount of damage. All right, perhaps one more attempt at this. <laughs> I keep getting attacked by everything. Oh, right. Finisher. <laughs> Double finisher. All right. The engine's destroyed. I can't believe we did it. Jigger Power Lao is safe. I just hope Sid's okay. He always manages. <laughs> yeah, he somehow does. I don't know how. Right, this could be like Vogel all over again. <laughs> Cece, you're awake. Cece, what's this thing? Not Cece. I'm... I'm... <laughs> Whoa, what's going on? Yeah. Oh, no. Raven, Cece. What in the world? Jigger Paralau was saved from the brink of disaster, but we wouldn't be there to share in its destiny. While the people of Jigger Power Lab were deciding their new future, our destiny was elsewhere. Oh no. What? <laughs> Sanya and Gade? <laughs> You're not an easy one to find. Long time no see, Gravity Queen. Where were you two? You've been gone for so long and just now you show up? Things are happening. We could have used your help. Some all-powerful creators you turned out to be. 
We have our reasons. And instant weakened our power. It's difficult for us to even maintain this form. We're only able to communicate with you now because this dimension works differently. What she said. You do never make any sense, but I don't have time to, for figuring it out now. I've got to get back to Raven and Cece. Well, there are a few other things you need to take care of first. The cracks in the dream that is this world are getting worse. We and the other have great uh, need for need of you. One other. One might not be accurate. He is everywhere in every in every when. <laughs> Am I? It's time to go. You need to hurry, Gravity Queen. Wait, what about Raven and Cece? Everything will come together soon enough. I think. You think? Well, I mean, it's been a while since I've seen these two. And just like that, they're gone. Only like two minutes of seeing the creators. <laughs> Talk about deja vu. <laughs> Chapter 3, Hexville. <laughs> yeah, so I'm somehow back in the city of Hexville. Hexville. Is this Hexville? How's that possible? Did I come back alone? Okay, stay calm. First things first, I should check on my old home. Uh, wow. <laughs> Let's see, I got Driver, increases the maximum distance of the Rocket Jump Lunar Style. Powerful Kick L, increases the damage dealt by Wormhole Kick. Okay. Increase the number of times you can evade slash block. Hmm. Alright, so, interesting. <laughs> Overview. Flick down on the touchpad to switch to the Jupiter Style, pretty much. While in Jupiter Star, your movement speed slows, but your attack power rises. Okay, so special moves. Okay, the Surge Kick, Debris Ball, yada yada, and then the Micro Block Hole. And then also, you can slide faster. <laughs> yeah, talk about a blast from the past, seriously. I'm literally the same... <laughs> Yeah, so literally, this is the same spot where Cat awoken in the very first game. <laughs> Oof. Alright, so... Loner. Jupiter. Alright. So, it's gonna be a while to get used to this. I mean, there's the apple, <laughs> there's the tree, I mean, this is like, same, same spot, so it's just so, uh, nostalgic. Let's see, that's closed off. Let's see, gotta go home. <laughs> if I remember correctly, Cat lives in a pipe, in a sewer pipe. Yeah, there it is. It's like they turned my home into a garbage dump. I don't see Cyania Gade. What happened to the city? I think a good question is how long she's, has she been gone? <laughs> oh, so much trash. Guess I better get started by recycling these old newspapers. Hey, this paper is talking about the Industria incident. Cat, the Gravity Queen, alias defeated, the town is safe. Alias, everything feels like it's happened so long ago. Hmm? Pandora's fortunes? We reveal the truth. Mademoiselle Aki. Aki? That's who I should go see. 
Uh, she can use her strange powers to tell me what's going on. Pandora's fortunes. Oh boy. So many new gems to collect. <laughs> I gotta say though, it was just kind of out of nowhere that I get thrown into the city again. I mean, it felt like we were just making... Making Jigga Power Lauer our new home, but... I guess, you know, good that we actually came back here. But a little bit confused as to why are we back here. Alright, just trying to get some more gems if I can. Um, yeah, I guess that'd be good for right now. <laughs> or at least I got a good majority of it. <laughs> Well, I mean, if it's anything like the first game, there's going to be a lot of gems all over the place. Right. Um, well, you know, speaking of which, I should probably, since I'm back in the city of Hexavale, I should probably start looking for new manholes whenever they pop up. Um, yeah, I'm going to need to look through another guide for that one, because I don't remember much anymore. <laughs> huh? Well, that's different. <laughs> What's this weird black building? What happened to Pandora's fortunes? Did she go out of business while I was gone? Everything's so different, like those weird robots hovering around town. What happened to Hexville? Episode 13. Yeah, just jumping straight into another episode. Alone again. Uh... Okay. Same as usual, just present square near people to in a town to strike up a conversation. Uh, yeah, all right. I mean, it's just, <laughs> uh, just trying to find out what in the world happened. Hello, mind if I ask you something? Of course not. You must be new around here. Need directions? Uh, oh no, I used to live here. What's the problem then? If you're selling something, I'm not buying. No, no, nothing like that. I just want to catch up on what's been happening lately. Well, if you're look, if you're just looking to chat, ask someone else. I'm a bit busy. Okay, thank you for your time. Did, did I just get brushed off? Doesn't anyone around here recognize me? Uh, okay... Um, excuse me, can you tell me if anything strange happened, Hexaville? <laughs> That's a strange question to ask someone out of nowhere. Well, I just got back in into town, so I'm a little behind on the latest news. Ah, well, it's good to hear a young person taking an interest in societal affairs. I suppose the big deal now is who's fit to be the new mayor. The new mayor? <laughs> Personally, I think the person responsible for our cutting-edge city defense system should... I'm not quite sure I follow him. Got it. Guess I should get go learn more about the defense system and the mayor. That's the spirit. You can never have enough knowledge, young one. <laughs> huh. Didn't that guy kind of look a little bit like... Oh, you know... What, what was that guy? Um... Man, yeah, uh, there was like a a little side quest near the beginning. 
in the first game, there was a side quest that required you to have a conversation with a guy and his wife. Um, what was his name? I'd like to say his name was Sigler, maybe? S Singler? S Sigler? I don't, I don't remember exactly. I, I mean, I remember... I remember it was about him and his wife somehow getting trapped in like a space-time dimensional rift thing where they keep bouncing back and forth between uh, time and space. And we just had to keep trying to find conversations, find out what happened to them. Yeah, I mean, that's what he, rem that's what he looked like. Or that's what he reminded me of anyway. I don't know if that ever really got solved. I mean, that, that quest just kind of just ended. I mean, without any real conclusion, so... Huh. I mean, who knows? Maybe those two might show up again. All right. Anyway, that's uh, hello. Nothing. Anyone trying to get some info here? Hey, could you tell me what those round robots wandering around do? Oh. Round robots? You mean the Grigos? <laughs> I, don't, I hope that's right. Is that what they're called? Sorry, I've been gone a while. Oh. Well, they're part of the town's defense system. They keep us safe. They record the daily goings on. And they'll perform police duty in a pinch. Really? These things can perform police duties? <laughs> Heck, if you ask me, they're better than the police. They're around when you need them. I see. They sound pretty impressive. Speaking of police, I wonder where Bobosa and Chaz are. Huh. <laughs> Bobosa and Chaz. Oh, yeah. I remember those two. I mean, they'll probably show up again later in this game. Citizen <laughs> registration? Wow, the robot can talk. Please submit your citizen registration. Registration? What's that? Registration is a civic duty. Please register at your earliest convenience. Huh. Wonder when that whole system went in. Unregistered citizens may experience several inconveniences. I'll bet registration is a big hassle. It's a real hassle. <laughs> I'll be sure to do it later. Repeat, unregistered citizens may experience several inconveniences. <laughs> Well, do I have to register myself or what? <laughs> uh, I'm kind of hungry. I should grab something to eat. Maybe one of the stalls in the plaza has something I could nibble on. Yeah, I mean, everything looks pretty much the same. For the most part, yeah. <laughs> I mean, if you play the first Gravity Rush, everything here would look pretty familiar. Excuse me, one sausage, please. <laughs> Come right up. Careful, it's piping hot. It smells fantastic. Oh, come on. They stole my sausage. Come back, bird. Give me back the sausage. Oh, this is like even trying to go faster. It not really helping much. So much for my meal. Oh, 
Income at Gravity Store? Seek shelter immediately? Wow. Defeat the Navi. Uh, a giant hand. A lot of all over the place. Oh, I don't remember them ever tackling me like that. Jesus, leave me alone. Oh, come on, stop tackling me. Okay. Whenever one of you goes down, more come to take its place. Is that hand growing out of the gravity storm controlling them? Maybe if I take him out, I can take the others out with it. Uh, well, worth a shot. If I can actually... Oh, that's... Thanks! Messed up my special. <laughs> God, <laughs> I can't get close to it. That actually worked. <laughs> Bubs deploy commencing gravity field absorption. Huh. They're sucking up the gravity storm? That's a first. What the? <laughs> Uh, who's she? Him, <laughs> I'm the town's guardian, Callie Angel. Huh? Guardian? <laughs> I don't have time to talk. No rest for the righteous. What? Another storm. More storms. So many storms. Okay. Let go. Ow. Okay, so who is this Cali Angel? Man, these so many. I should just focus on the hands. Oh, not again. Ow. Right, that's two. <laughs> I'm getting an attack by everything. All right, <laughs> last hand. Careful, careful. <laughs> All right, just a few more in the V. Well, I gotta say, this Kelly Angel's pretty impressive. Being able to take care of these Navi, too. 
But she's almost like a... Well, she's kind of almost like Cat. Except she's no gravity shifter. <laughs> has been lifted. That's good. That was incredible. Thanks, Kelly Angel. Wow. When I grow up, I want to be an angel. You promise? My little angel, I love to have a sister like you. I love you, Kelly. Huh. Ah, move it, will ya? I can't see Kelly with you in the way. Huh. Huh? Wait. It is it is you. When did you get back? Hey, Pops, over here. Oh, hey, Cat. Hey, I remember these two. Ajin. So, that means you're... Yuji, but don't go making a big deal about how big I got. Kid hit a growth spurt bound to be bigger after three years. <laughs> Wait, three years? I had returned alone to Hexville, and the years that passed, it had a new defense system and a new hero. The time distortion effects from the, my interdimensional journey left me with some ch uh, catching up to do. Wow, it's been three years since she's been gone. Yay? <laughs> uh, how do I uh, put this delicately? Your... I'm... You know, you're no longer... Uh, I'm no good with wars lately. No longer relevant. Is that what you trying to, <laughs> were trying to say? <laughs> yes, exactly. Thanks for covering me, boy. <laughs> Pop's mind is scattering lately. It's scattered lately, probably from all the drinking. That has nothing to do with it. Wait until you're older, you'll understand. <laughs> and they haven't changed much. By the way, have you heard about... Anything about Pandora's fortunes? Oh, that place. It moved while you were gone. I saw the new one was over in Plejune. Plejune, the entertainment district? Pops knows that place like the back of his hand. He goes there every day. <laughs> Can I get a little respect? You're all lip nowadays. And you smell like boobs nowadays. <laughs> I do, but I've only had one shot today. They're about to get into it. <laughs> Uh, I should leave and go find Aki. <laughs> okay, yeah, I should probably get to play June next. <laughs> wow. Yeah, so, that's a big shock. It's been three years since Cat's been gone from the city. Although, has three years actually passed when she's been gone? Or is it just because of the, the uh, dimensional shift and, you know, the time... Displacement has been changed that makes it seem like she's only been gone for like a few months or whatever <laughs> ah, I mean that's kind of a big shock though <laughs> Wait, at least it's good to see some familiar faces again <laughs> but uh, Yeah, I guess I'll leave it at that for right now as uh, Yeah, I'm starting to run a little bit past my recording time All right, so I guess afterwards I'm gonna Next time I'm going to probably go to the Plejun district and uh, meet up with Aki and try to find out what in the world is going on in the city. <laughs> Alright guys, this is Devil Hunter XYZ, and until next time.